In this ancient city, change comes slowly. Narrow stone streets are almost the same as they were when the Medici family ruled more than 500 years ago. The Industrial Revolution, world wars, and a flood forced change, but one factory has not changed. At the Antico Settificio Fiorentino, or the Antique Silk Factory of Florence, the sounds of mechanical looms remind us of the past. These noisy 19th century looms create some of the world's finest silk fabrics for drapery and upholstery. But here, they are the new machines. On the other side of the factory are the real pieces of history. Stefano Benelli weaves silk fabric that machines cannot create and he does it slowly and carefully, one thread at a time. These looms were built in 1780, and they use the same principles of weaving used for centuries before that. Everything is done like it was done in, in the ancient time, but we continue to do an evolution continuously. We invent, we create continuously, but using the old looms. All the other factories threw away their old hand looms after World War II. Only the Cetificio now uses hand looms. Usually silk has three to four thousand threads running in one direction, but the silk produced on the antique hand looms has twelve thousand threads. It is much stronger and more beautiful. Fabric from the Cetificio cannot be found in stores and catalogs. It is custom made. Some people may think that making silk on a hand loom is difficult and boring, but Benelli enjoys it. But the mind, it's okay. <laughs> not stressful, yeah. Perhaps no other city on earth has preserved the grandeur and the grace of the Renaissance, as well as Florence. It is appropriate then that here, at the Antico Cetificio Fiorentino, style and tradition are woven together. <laughs>